Howdy gang from Loveland, Colorado. We are um, in Colorado for the next few days with fullstrength.ai for the Shaw Classic, but I wanted to take a moment to quickly go over what the plans are for the UNS workshop, which we are doing in September, uh, three days in a row, um, including the foundation, which will take place at the end of August. So we're gonna do a one hour foundation workshop that's gonna be available to everyone. It's gonna be the foundation of Unified Namespace, where it came from, um, what is its purpose, how do organizations benefit from it, uh, how, how is the UNS an architecture that helps service manufacturers achieving the holy grail of becoming a company made up of smart factories. So that's foundation, that's at the end of August. Then there's gonna be three consecutive sessions. What is, the, the, the reason we're doing this workshop now as opposed to doing it in the past is we are doing this in conjunction with the Prove It conference that's taking place in February. The UNS handbook that's been being, being released on LinkedIn one chapter at a time between now and Prove It. It actually, it'll, most of the, all the chapters should be released by the end of the year. What we're gonna be doing in this workshop is in session number one, we're gonna be doing all of the background elements of UNS. We're gonna introduce you to the virtual factory that we're gonna be building a unified namespace in. It is the same virtual factory that's gonna be used for the Prove It conference. So all of the vendors who are building um, solutions on a common infrastructure for Prove It, when, they're, when they get their functional specs, they're gonna be using the same UNS that I'm gonna be teaching in the, in the UNS uh, workshop. Okay, so that first session, we're gonna be doing the foundation, introducing you to the facility. We're gonna be introducing you to all of the edge devices that are available in that facility. And we're gonna be walking through the architecture on how we're designing the unified namespace before we connect to anything, okay? Session two is gonna be us going through all the types of namespaces. So functional, descriptive, ad hoc, and informative for that virtual factory. And then session number three is gonna be taking that unified namespace that we built for this virtual factory, which is based on an actual manufacturing facility based in Dallas, which is the exact same manufacturing facility we're using for the Prove It conference. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna integrate that into cloud. And we're gonna be able to do that because this client who already has an existing unified namespace, we're gonna be able to show essentially five years of work in three sessions, okay? Those three sessions are gonna take about a, a total of 12 hours, give or take, between three and four hours for each session. It's gonna be a lot to jam in, but it's gonna be worth it. So if you're going to, if you're going to prove it, you definitely want to be part of the workshop. If you're in Mastermind, the workshop is included as part of your Mastermind tuition. So you don't have, all you gotta do is just make sure you sign up so you get the links, but it's already included in your in your tuition and those of you who are not in mastermind i know that there's it's available for people who are not in mastermind i don't know all the commercials how much it costs or anything like that i'm just teaching it but it is available it's this is this is going to be the first time that anyone is going to build a unified namespace publicly in a workshop and the reason why and it's going to be completely functional cradle to the grave edge to cloud and the reason why is because we've gotten permission from a manufacturer to use their infrastructure and data to do it. And I can't tell you guys enough how difficult that is uh, to get a manufacturer to agree to that, okay? And, and we're fortunate that this manufacturer has partnered with us and, and has given us the opportunity to essentially do a workshop showing people how to do this with their actual um, industrial process, all right? so. If you have any questions, comment down below. This is, I think this is a LinkedIn video. Comment down below. Uh, if there's anything specifically you wanna see covered, the curriculum's already been written out, but we, we ha I have some room to add in additional things. If you, if there's anything you want me specifically cover in that workshop, and, uh, and I'll hope to see you there.